Hi, I'm Paul Robbins, and here's something you may not have known about agriculture. You know, most of us think about crops when it comes to farming. Uh, corn, soybean, wheat, oats, and after all, there are vast stretches of open farmland that are perfect for that all across the heartland. But what about a different kind of harvest? A growing number of farmers are adding fish to the products that they raise for consumers, and many are raising them in spots that are a long way from the ocean or any body of water. And while you may think that fish farming is the latest in agricultural output, it's a practice that goes way back in time. Thousands of years ago, farmers in China were harvesting small fish and then raising them in ponds to be used for food when they grew to maturity. Carp were a big favorite. I, I love a good carp burger. Ancient hieroglyphics show that Egyptians tried fish farming using waters from the Nile. So it was only a matter of time before these early fish farming efforts spread, or uh, swam, across the Mediterranean. The early Romans jumped into the game not only trying their hand at fish, but successfully farming oysters in saltwater ponds. And if you check the history of the Hawaiian Islands, residents there set up extensive netting areas in the waters offshore. But fish farming in its modern form was first introduced in the 1700s when a German farmer successfully gathered fish eggs, fertilized them, and raised trout to be used for food. Initially, almost all of that fish farming was done in freshwater ponds or tanks, but developments in the 20th century made possible saltwater breeding. Today, fish farmers raise a wide variety of seafood, both in ponds, onshore, and in special nets in lakes and oceans. In the U.S., catfish, trout, salmon, tilapia, and striped bass are the favorite crops of fish farmers. And you'll find that some farmers rotate their crops, even in the finned variety. Fish ponds are also being used to raise shrimp to help compete with shrimp that are being produced and harvested primarily in Asia. And we should mention that fish farming is also used for ornamental fish as well. Goldfish, guppies, swordtails swimming happily in their aquariums, close to but not on the dinner table.